Hi, in this session we will talk about ordering lab orders. Lab orders are ordered, um, you must be in the orders tab and you can click on the lab order. You can click on this add button which will bring up a search window where you can search for lab orders or you can use the favorites folder for labs. So I'm going to order a basic lab. I'm going to go to the lab folder and I'm going to select BMP. And when you select BMP this order sentences window opens where I want to define what these mean. T means today, T plus 1 means tomorrow, 0300 is the military time, 3 in the morning. Now all the labels print at that time, they don't draw the blood at that time, so therefore this is the default blood draw for tomorrow morning. So the laboratory folks um, get a sticker that printed, and then about 5, 6 in the morning is when they go and draw the blood. And so they want all the uh, rec uh, stickers printing correctly at the right time, and therefore we are going to, we are recommending that you use this order sentence for tomorrow morning now this one means t plus one o three hundred tomorrow morning but it also means q o three hundred which means every morning and then for three dose times which means uh... which means uh... three days in a row so that's three mornings in a row of bmp this one means uh... next week at three in the morning every week for two weeks um, routine blood draw is done within the next two hours. Um, this is a routine to be collected. Uh, T and N means today and N means now. So every Mondays and Thursdays for two Mondays and Thursdays. And this is Tuesdays and Fridays for two Tuesdays and Fridays. This one's stat. Stat blood work gets done within the 30 minutes. Has to be drawn and resulted. And a time study is when you define the specific time for that lab to be drawn very specifically the military date and time so I'm gonna to select tomorrow morning for BMP okay and I'm gonna select troponin here down here so now this one looks a little bit different this one says blood routine star 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 Q6 hours for two dose times and what this means is that I'd like to draw a troponin every six hours for two dose times and it has to be a timed meaning that I know I need to know when to start that Q6 hours times two um, so I'm gonna click OK here and I'm also gonna select uh, um, um, add-on lab so I'm gonna search add-on and notice how there's an add-on lab so add-on blood work is blood work that was blood you wanna have additional tests ordered on on a previous s sample for instance from the ED and I just want to define uh, blood culture here. Okay, so here's blood culture. Here it says Q1 hour times two doses. That means it's not going to be drawn every hour. It's going to be drawn twice within the same hour from two different sites. So that's your a set of blood cultures. The three means that I want one from the port or a line in addition to two peripheral blood samples. So Q one hour times two is your two blood cultures. Um, if you click on uh, microbiology, there's a group of other orders that can be ordered. Uh, for instance, I'm going to order urine culture here, and I'm going to say stat nurse collect. I'm going to click OK, click done, and and notice how um, I'm, I've closed my search box and I have a set of series of details to fill out, and they're marked by this blue colored X. If I click five missing required details here in troponin, it says, well, we're going to do Q6 hour times two doses here, two duration, duration unit, dose times. But what by what date and time? So let's say I want today. And here you want to be very careful of what time to start. But let's say the ED took the troponin at uh, nine in the morning. Uh, sorry, let's say, for instance, 12 noon to make it easier. Uh, the next six hours from now would be 1800. So 1800 would be 6 p.m. and so the next draw would be 1800. You want to be careful of the current time because um, you can't order uh, in the past. You can only order in the future. So um, that defines the the cy cycling labs. Now let's look at add-on lab. So for add-on lab order, you must define the specimen that they're going to use. So let's say, for instance, I'm going to use a blood sample. I could have picked anything else from here like sputum or CSF or so I'm going to select blood and then here I'm going to type in the result the type in the tests that I want so let's say in the ED they drew a BMP and a CBC and a set of coags
but let's say let's say I also want I and R. Let's say I also want a magnesium, and let's say I want to also order a phosphorus. So I'm typing those in here, and so the lab's going to do the best that it can to find the blood to run those additional tests. If not, it will order them. But this lets them know to add on additional tests. The blood culture, you could left click on it, and here it's not really important to worry about this. I would just click away. Here it's just going to ask you when do you want the blood cultures to be done. And here you could click up and down. So for today, you know, up and down defines your date. And then here maybe I want a time in the future, like maybe I want a, a, a 1700, so like 5 p.m. I want those blood cultures. Um, and here's a urine culture, and here you must define the, the type of urine, kidney, nephrostomy, where do they get the urine from. And I always select urine uh, clean catch. Um, and that's all that needs to be defined here. It's a stat test. Of note, please do not order stat tests for the future. And also of note, for the cycling order, um, it, the system will not accept uh, cycling orders such as like Q1, Q2, Q3, Q4. And Q5. It is not approved frequency. And uh, you can only order durations here of 1, 2, and 3. You cannot do a duration of 4, 5, 6 with a dose times. Once One can also cannot order lab tests with year, week, second. It, has to on, it can only order lab tests with a dose times as an option. And duration of, as I said, 1, 2, or 3. Um, and then uh, frequency cannot be lesser than Q6 hours. Um, and then other frequencies like QAM, QDAY, none of those will be approved. They're not approved uh, frequencies. So um, just additional information on ordering labs. All lab tests require a date and a time. Um, and also please remember that any morning labs should be done that the next day at 0300 is the time to put. Um, and that concludes the session. I'm going to click sign and I'm going to order these labs into the system. And you, if you click refresh, you'll see that these labs have been ordered. Thank you.